Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a whole lot. Actually, I've done it lot already and I'm excited. Like, it's just like past 10 in the morning and I feel the whole video. Everything works together for my good. I don't know if there's no disturbance. When you need nepa, you need all my neighbors to be quiet, not chicken to be making noise. <laughs> everything just to be insane and i was able to film the video i don't know if you can hear now but you just started making noise with their song so i'm just happy i was able to film and if you have not watched that video because i'm going to post it for this one it's talking about all you need to know as a doctor before coming to nigeria or post house job all you need to know in this medical practice as a foreign trained i'm focusing on the foreign trained doctors because as a little bit different from the rest so i'll be telling you everything and i dropped all the information i need to know and if there's anyone that i do not answer you can ask me i'll definitely answer you if you are seeing this face and you literally watch my videos and you do not subscribe don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up today okay i'm done filming and i'm just going to run some errands guys let me just tell you <laughs> so my husband's baby is in few days and i'm trying to like just do something small for him and i want to i already ordered some things and they have arrived i'm supposed to go and pick them up but the thing is i don't know where i'm going to hide all those things that you won't see it before the birthday that's the constraint i have now i don't know i'm going to do it i'm just going to change now i'm going to pick them up but i have to find a place to put it in this house because it has to remain a surprise yeah that's what i want to do i just hope i'm able to put it up So I'll see you guys. This outfit is definitely not complete until I put on something to make me warm. And today I'm using this uh, poncho. Is it poncho or pocho? I don't know. It's like a knitted uh, turtleneck cape. I don't know what to call it. But anyways, it also has tassels and I really like it. Just makes my outfit simple and also keeps me very, very warm. I'm not about to go and freeze outside. Okay, yes, it's another morning and for the past two days, I've not been able to show you guys because we've been almost at the same place at the same time and he didn't go out for anything, so I couldn't show you guys. Anyway, let's keep that because I will be going for outreach. If you ever joined NCCF as a copper, you know that we do rural rugged every year and this is the time and the season for our own rural rugged we're going today this morning i'm already dressed because it's very very cold i am wearing just this free um turtleneck with this i don't know how to call it like with these shorts anyways i'll be going I won't be won't be back until the night before the birthday so anyways that's it i'll take you guys along and whenever i can show you i will show you so what do you say you wanted to use these trousers for for jogging jogging which which in which century i was going to sleep with you today not like this i was going to sleep with you today yes. Guess what? He has been keeping this for over 10 years. <laughs> I didn't even know. Uh, so I'm the one that is enjoying it now. 
thank you for keeping these trousers for me because I actually love it. back from the camp we're back from the rural rugged evangelism and it was actually a very very beautiful experience i definitely vlogged but it's a separate video and i will be showing you guys all that happened and what you need to know before planning for um that kind of outreach and i hope the video really helps you anyways this video is not about that this video is like a vlog and i'm planning my husband's birthday as you all know and the assistant's birthday girl so it's a monday and i'm going to <laughs> i'm going to show you guys the drama that's happened so far because it's a monday and usually i'm supposed to go to work he slept in the hospital sunday night slash monday morning because he was on call so he came home this morning that's the monday morning and he was like okay he just needs to take his bath and quickly just change and go back because they have regular clinic that's how the um schedule is so i was like okay i'm also going to walk oh, ah, and i dressed up we actually <laughs> we dressed up together we dressed up together and we left the house so when when i had gotten like halfway he already told me bye bye i told him bye bye okay I was going to stay some work i was also going and then i now told the bike to just turn back and drop me in the house because i wore i'll show you what i wore i wore something like i was actually going to walk meanwhile i was going to the market <laughs> anyways i got back to the house changed quickly and just to wear this i just wear something simple because i was going to the market and i went to the market this morning to buy meat i want to make stick meat and i could even stay at home because i wasn't sure when he was going to finish um finish at the clinic i didn't know when he was going to come home from work so i just told mercy i'm sure people have seen her like 10 times in this and this channel she's here and i'm in our house now we're making the stick meat and i'll just make it and keep it here this is past three usually i'm done from work and he was expecting ah you're not done from work i'm like no the person that's supposed to come and take over for me is not yet around so i have to wait so it's like ah, okay oh, this your work is is delaying today i didn't even say anything I'm here trying to finish up with the stick meat and I'll leave it here and then I go back home like I'm just coming back from work. I think it's going to catch me because this is not the clothes I wore. I will change the story for you. 
I will find a way to change the story that I came back because I was cold. So and now, another um, issue I'm having is how to take him out of the house, drop the things, because cake is ready, some other things are ready, but I don't know where I'm going to drop them. Because he's in the house now, I don't know where I'm going to drop every single thing. But we have to make this surprise work. Or is it going to fail? <laughs> Let's see. I really hope I can catch his expression when we do the old surprise thing. I really hope I can pull it off. Fingers crossed, guys. Will I fail? Or it will work. I hope. Bless you. I hope it's not an epic fail. Bye. Let's get to work. So I was like, ah, I didn't know much about it, but in the end, I was like, ah, is this guy proud or what? Is this? <laughs> but um, getting to know him, I saw that he was a very calm person, um, caring, supportive, um, easygoing. You know, found someone with a big heart, you know, a large heart for people, and it has shown over his life very mature. Very, very much of, as I always say, kind, wise, and um, the list goes on and on. I can't exhaust it. But personally, to me, he's not just a friend, he's a brother. To me, he's a brother. Oh my god, oh my god. I'm crying. I really, really um, I don't take the relationship, the friendship, the brotherhood for granted. I really see it as a privilege and um, I really thank God for connecting me and associating me with you. You know, um, I'm really, really grateful for that opportunity and um, I can't really describe the extent of the impact. <laughs> You have in my life already. Tissue. can't go into details. It's really, it's really, really deep. You know, everything about your life speaks. Oh. Everything about your life speaks, and it speaks good. It speaks good. Like it's good to be a Christian. It's good to serve mm. God. It's good to live that life for God. And it's good to be sacrificial mm. to God. So, for the minute you're controlling around him with his wife, everything, everything about that speaks, and um, it's just my heart cry and prayer that God will establish all that is for you. You go far, 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 and you 
fulfill all that God has in mind for you. Everything that he wants to accomplish with you on this earth that God will establish all that that is. Found. I want to say that I love you. I love you too, bro. Ready for your feet? Check on that. Got you back. Yeah. <laughs> what did you think when you come back from work and you're like? Because yeah. I was coming back from work, and I didn't get anything from work. I just worked. Okay, you thought I was surprised you had work or something. I was trying to figure out what I would do. My wife needs to do something, and she's just going to allow it to go. I wasn't so sure. So at work, I just did my work. I was hoping that they would just open the door and I just be surprised. Nothing came. I did my work and thank God I touched some life stone. I was able to give money to some patients, I fed the gift. Yeah, you said that. Yeah. Femi is calling me. Okay, pick Femi is calling. And then I called you again or you called me. I can't remember. Yeah, you called me that Safra and my sisters were going to say, yeah, that I will be coming. Or, I was thinking you said yes, I have two months waiting for you. But then you said you had to work hard at work and past three. That's great. They said, go home and sleep and go and break uh, fast in the evening. We will sleep. I will enjoy my night with my wife. We will be fine. So, but as I was coming on the bike this afternoon from my work, when that was started coming, maybe this woman is actually at home. Maybe I'm waiting for you at home. Yeah. <laughs> people are inside the house that we just 
come and then uh, see a lot of people. So when I got there, I checked the front of the room, there was no slippers, nothing, nothing. I said, okay, they packed with the slippers. He and thought I'd open the door, you're surprised. Yeah. <laughs> so I got to the door, I said, I was looking, peeking through the door. Ah, this place is quiet. That means my wife took all these people inside the room. Uh, immediately, I opened the door, and then we just opened this curtain and jumped out. <laughs> I opened the door. <laughs> Ah, nobody opened. You searched the, the toilet too. I left the door open. I moved the this thing. I did not see anything. I said, okay. That means they can't be in the country. So I just came back to remove my shoe. So I was like, okay, let me check the bedroom. <laughs> I don't know what is this. <laughs> I checked the bedroom. Let's see. They just gave me a sat down, pressing my phone. And I said, okay, let me break my fast. Okay, so. I sat down my bed. I was waiting for you to come. So when Sister Lami came with that cake, I was like, okay. Eat the cake. Eat the cake. <laughs> you really thought I was a birthday cake? We eat the cake now. It's not bad. And we just. Well, the cake was really nice. Yeah, it was nice. Very sweet now. So we went for prayers. Did and you suspect? At that point in time, no. At that point in time, in the evening, me, I was not expecting anything again. Yeah. And I was not bothered. I was happy. There is nothing. There is not a must. So that's the mindset. So I wasn't suspecting. Even when I was coming with Brother Martin and Sister Becky, I wanted to tell them that. Enough, or you can go back home now. Yeah, I was not doing anything. I was with my wife, did not do anything. I was banking on this cake to give them. Uh... And when they come, <laughs> I will cut that. Don't let me talk. Don't let me try and tell them to go back. When they come, I will cut the cake. I will give them, I will give them. And that was literally, I wanted to open the door. I just saw messy slippers. I said, Ah, this is set up. These people. <laughs> Now we saw till this after and I opened the door and I saw the surprise. <laughs> I was so happy. Anyways, guys, I am tired. We have come to the end of today's vlog and yes, I won. I got him. I got him <laughs> and I'm happy I got him. Did you like your gifts, by the way? Yeah. I do. Okay, so I'll see you guys in my next vlog. I need to go and rest. There's work tomorrow. Bye, guys.